Okay, we're going into summer six. The, the need for kegs is becoming rather acute. So I'm gonna have to, and I'm not in a, in a good way. So I'm gonna have to probably really grind out some oak resin and then spend all my money probably buying stuff. Um, but in this day in game, um, gotta look at the greenhouse, try and get some more radioactive ore, which means I'm gonna need more hardwood as well to make the heavy tappers, which is fine. I can get hardwood easily enough. Um, do I get the marble for the marble brazier? Although that's not really super important. Because I can do that anytime. So that's not really important. And, and then we, we do want to give Demetrius a puffer fish because that is a story quest. I must try to remember Gus's birthday on the 8th. want to make sure I give Gus a gift. <laughs> do some Gus gifting. Uh, but yeah. Really, it's just we're on that grind for kegs, which means I need more oak resin. And iron. I have some copper. Not enough copper, but anyways. Um, who here ever had those aviator sunglasses? That's literally what... Those are my community... My community large sunglasses are my are aviators. So needless to say, I'm also... I'm looking to try and find the next batch of community, uh, of community large sunglasses because... It's a rather good joke, I think. Alright, so... The starfruit's coming along... Do I have a note on when my star fruit is going to be done on Ginger Island? I don't. But I was on Ginger Island yesterday and they weren't done. So in theory, I shouldn't need to go back right, right away. I should have written that down. Uh, but we'll just ignore that for now. Speaking of ignoring, I will just check the coop. Nothing I care about. And I'll pet the other one. Ooh, we got more open Sweet. Okay, that's good. Uh, let's just go pop into here. Let's get this whole area cleared out. I guess I could give cherries as gifts too, couldn't I? I should see if everyone loves cherries. That would be good. Alright, so I think today of all days, I'm going to make a point of downing this triple shot. Keep the triple shot going. Let me grab the oak resin, because I need as much as possible, as quickly as possible. I wonder if I should grab some of the uh, hardwood while I'm over here. That would be a terrible idea, actually. Let me just grab a little bit more, huh? Huh. Having fewer animals is quite nice. Okay, that's all good. Let's grab that. That's actually a decent, uh, a decent number. I think. We'll, we'll just say it's a decent number. Okay, so. I need more... Iron. Okay, actually now, well, wood. I'm short on wood. Ooh, I'm really short on wood. Okay, that's fine. Uh, I wonder if I can come up with a couple more blocks of iron. Let's, we'll see about that. So I can make 12 kegs. So if I have two more pieces, two more blocks of iron, or ink iron bars, I can make two more kegs. Good. Um... Let's get some uh, coffee going. Let's see here. Ooh, that's adds, that adds up. Put those two there. Two of those there. Great. Okay. That's on the go. I have a heavy tapper on me. Crap, I should have replaced one of the ones that was done. Which one was done? Um, one of these guys, maybe, or like... Well, this guy over here is probably done, so let's just replace this one. There we go. Okay, that's good. So, this is good. Like, this, I'm hoping this is, we're going to get to the point where, um... Hopefully. Hopefully we're going to get to the point where, uh... We can just start blitzing these kegs. The sooner I get the kegs done, the better. Really. Just really need some kegs. 
All right. I also need some iron. I'm tempted just to buy it, but I have 500,000. I could buy an obelisk. I could buy an obelisk. Which obelisks can I buy? Uh, let's have a look. Obelisk. 500,000. Uh, oh. Weird. Uh, should tell me something about the wizard. Warp totems. Oh, obelisk. I don't want the warp totem, I want the obelisk. In farm obelisk. Nope. Ginger, oh, crap. Okay, I was hoping to do that the easy way. Let's look up a wizard. Wizard's tower. Okay, so 500,000. I could get... Hmm. The, the, the beach or the mountains. That's not really worth doing. And I don't have the iridium bars either. Ooh, that's not good. At some point, I'm going to have to... I should probably... I'm trying to decide what's more important. Getting to Ginger Island faster or getting to the desert faster? I'm thinking probably Ginger Island because the desert, I can just use desert totems, which are fairly easy to get and easy to trade for with um, Omni Geodes. So, yeah, we gotta say, we gotta get to that million. Once we've cleared a million, we'll get the island obelisk right away, and then I won't have to worry about hey, is it done or is it not done? I can just go look. Okay. So, it is Saturday. Should I do some gifting today as well? That is the question. Because it's the last chance I'm going to have to do any gifting this week. So, I don't need cherries for anything, do I? No. Just sell some. And the mangoes. And the bananas. And I think that's it. Yeah. So I'm trying to get two more kegs, so I need ten more wood, nine more wood. That's not going to be a problem. Um, and two more iron bars should also not be a huge problem. I'd like to get some more heavy tappers. That requires 30 hardwood, so I definitely need more hardwood. Um, which do I have in here? Ooh, I have quite a bit, actually. That's good. How much do I still need for other stuff? 53. Alright, well, let's leave 53 in there. So 66. Now you need how much? 30? Oof. I can only make two more. Yike. Okay, well, let's uh, let's do this. Let's drop this hay off in the... Whatchamacallit? Silo. Just so I, to get out of my inventory. There we go. We're half full again. And let's go see... I'm tempted to do gifting, to be honest. But it takes so much time. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to bother. Okay, if I need to... Let's, let's see who I need to gift. I'll gift people who are convenient to gift. So, Sebastian and Maru. I'm hopefully, are going to be convenient. And what else am I doing today? Just the mine. So, I think I've done the dwarf. Actually, have I gifted them already? Sebastian, not at all. Maru, not at all. I'm trying to marry Maru. I should really uh, get on that. So, that's for Maru. That's for Maru. That's for Sebastian. Pretty sure I have given the dwarf all of the gifts. Yes, I have. I do want to give Gus, I think. I want to give Gus something. Yes, because if I give Gus a diamond, the next time I see Gus on his birthday in two days, I can give him the tropical curry, and that should max out Gus, which would be awesome. Um, okay, so we still want to get some more kegs. I do need some more wood and two more block pieces of iron. I gotta write this down. <laughs> so we need nine wood two iron bars, two radioactive bars, and that'll be good for today, I think. Um, now, to make tree fertilizer, because I do want to go harvest some trees to get some more wood, I need fiber and stone. I'm really short on fiber. This is a problem. I have 33. 
Not a lot. Wow. Six. Sweet. All right, well, let's go see Demetrius, I guess. That's rough. I'm hoping I have the iron, um... Already smelting, maybe, if I'm lucky? I don't know. I think I may have still smelted all my iron already. There's Demetrius, there's Maru. Let's give Lady Maru and Diamond. Let's give Demetrius his puffer fish. Sweet, that one's done. I can mark it off my list right here. Beautiful. So that's the last puffer fish I need. So if, I think I have another puffer fish somewhere. That's getting sold. Um, okay, this is going well. This is going very well. I'm supposed to reach level 100 in the skull cavern. It's not especially likely to happen. Sebastian here? Sebastian's not here. Where the heck is Sebastian at 10 o'clock on a Saturday morning? What? Sebastian, summer. Thursday? Saturday. Oh, he's heading down to Haley and Emily's house. Should I take the time to do that? I don't know if I should. Might be able to catch him. Ah, uh, no, this is wait, this, I shouldn't have done this. Oh well, whatever. It's too late. He's getting a gift. Oh, we have this quest. Who's the quest for? It's for Clint. Haven't I maxed out Clint already? I have, okay. I shouldn't have done this. This is such a waste of time. There's Kent, there's Sam. There's, there he is. Okay. Uh, now let's go to the... Now I need to cut down some trees, actually. So let's do this. I don't think I can cut down any of these trees. I think I can't do it on this map. Or in this section of town. So I'll head up to the top. There should be a couple, if I haven't cut them down already, there should be a couple of, uh, like, pine trees or something. Well, there's a pine tree, there's a pine tree, there's a maple. We're good. And there we go. That is more than enough wood. Okay, so I'll cut down the rest of them. I need to feed the wood. This tree that uh, Linus is hiding behind. Do see an artifact spot here too? What's this? Ancient doll. I've got that one already. Okay. So, what the heck? Let's cut. Let's complete the collection. Okay. There's a grape over there. All right. So, what do I have in anything here? Oh, nice. I have enough. Oh, and I have three radioactive bars. That is awesome. So I can make two heavy tappers, and I can make two more kegs. There we go. So now we're out of oak resin again. Let's pop back into here. Kind of. I hope I'm not shooting myself in the foot by waiting and not uh, by waiting and not um, filling all this in now. I mean, I could, I could be putting stuff in there right now, and I'm not. That might come back to haunt me. All right. It's coming along, though. We are, we are getting there. So I'm thinking... Actually, hold up. Where, where, where am I going now? Uh, more hardwood, I can get another heavy tapper. Which should be good. I do need more iron. Maybe let's do some mining while I'm here. Come in. No peering things. Okay, let's uh, let's grab some iron. Some iron and some radioactive ore is the goal. 
Anything? No. Leave. Not messing around with these levels. Bit of coal, I'll take it. Nothing. Yike. Let's try level 50. 50. Fif. Here we go. Don't care about, don't even care about the baddies right now. I just want the iron. Is there any more iron around? Wow, it's dark on this level, isn't it? Mess those guys up. Oh, there's some iron. I just got a copper bar from that. Sweet. No more iron, hey? Wow. Okay, it's fine. Nothing. Wow. Okay. Wow. I should take screenshots. I'm not wasting time. I'm wasting more time. This level, we've got a ladder, and that's it. So I'll take the ladder. I guess I knew that already. If I was going to do that, I should have just gone, but whatever. Oof, those guys are nasty. Those weird-looking ghosts that spit stuff at you all the time. I'm just going to go down to the next level. Uh, anything I care about here? No, I'm just going to leave. Uh, okay, if I have some iron... And I do. Let's throw it in a furnace. Because once I really start getting the um, watch my columns, the oak resin, I'm r really gonna need to have the iron and the the iron situation is going to have to be complete at that point. <laughs> Nothing. Okay. Wouldn't mind some more radioactive ore, too, to be honest. Nobody's home. Okay. Back to the top. Looking for iron and radioactive ore. Nothing. Except, except for things are going to fly at me. I remember doing a free-only run. What's up, uh, Kim? Kimry? Um, what's a free only run? Oops, that's the wrong thing. Oh, a tree only run. What's a tree only run? <laughs> I should probably be washing my health here, actually. This seems. Ooh, there's a purple mushroom over there, though. Maybe I'll grab the purple mushroom. My. Okay, I'm gonna die before I get to the purple mushroom here. Maybe I'll eat, like, a salmon berry or something. Just- Oh, I just grew trees on the farm. Oh, I see what you're saying. Gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, I have a decent amount of trees. Well, actually, my my main tree farm is by the train station. Um, which I would imagine I could probably go back to at some point and, uh... Harvest. Okay, uh, there's a lot of- As much as I want that coal, I don't want to mess around this level if I don't need to. Also, oh, it's Hizzy. I changed my name. Well, hello, the person formerly known as Hizzy. I remember you. How's it going? What is up? Do I have any more iron? No. Sweet. Doing good? Excellent, excellent. Good to hear you're just stopping by. Well, I appreciate it. Thank you very much. Glad you're doing well. Thank you for stopping by. I do appreciate it. Boy, howdy. I could really use some, uh, some radioactive ore out here. I'll take the iron, but dang. Nah, I'm not messing around with this. Nope. Time to goo. Oh, there's a bomb, that's nice. And a cherry bomb, sweet. Oh, my inventory is full. Um, Let's throw out that. That's only worth like one gold. 
All right. So I can't make any more. I could go put those heavy tappers back on some trees. Um, I do need more fiber. Wait, I can, you can do like fiber seeds now or something, can you? Do I have the recipe for fiber seeds? That's grass starter. Wild seeds. Oh, fiber seeds. Needs mixed seeds, sap, and clay. Does not require watering hard. Six, seven days to grow. I mean, that might be worth doing. Because... I need the fiber for tree fertilizer. Or is it? Maybe I should just buy the wood. How much bug meat do I need? I think I was hanging on to bug meat for something. Bug meat. I need 25 bug meat. Sweet. All right, let's do this. Let's bail. Do I want to pick that up? I don't think so. Uh, can I make another tree fertilizer? I can't. Sweet. All right. Uh, okay, so here's what we're going to do. I might just go do some wood harvesting. Um, I might just do that. Let's add a bunch of stuff in there. Oh, I have 80 bug meat. What do I need the bug meat for? I need bug meat for... I think I need to make a sturdy ring. I think that's it. It's a sturdy ring. It takes two copper bars, 25 slime. Do I have the recipe for it? I do have the recipe for it. Let's just make it. Let's get, let's get it off my list. Two of those. 25 bug meat. And 50 slime? Is that what it was? I don't know. Uh, boop. Sturdy ring is done. Back over here. Mark sturdy ring. Off. Bug meat's gone. Right, so I don't need any more bug meat. That's good. I can use it for bait if I need it or whatever. But probably won't make a point of keeping it. <clears throat> Speaking of not keeping stuff, I really, really don't need this ring. Oh. Okay. I wonder if those kegs being done means the kegs of the quarry are done. That might be a thing that needs to be ascertained forthwith. Let's just get this coffee refilled. There we go. Make some more triple shot. Thank you. Put any extra coffee. No extra coffee. Put the coffee beans in there. Never mind, put that there. Okay, so we'll quickly check the quarry. How much slime do I need now? Slime. Oh, I don't need any more slime either. Sweet. Okay, I'm going to sell the slime. Let's sell some stuff, then we'll go up to the quarry, see if there's anything there that we need. Sell you, sell you. Bat wings, don't need any more. Sell you. Um, kind of want to keep everything else. Gus. I want to give Gus a diamond. Let's go. Let's, let's, okay. Yeah, we want to do that for sure. Should I do that now? I can do that later. He'll be at the saloon till ridiculous o'clock. Okay, so quarry. Are they done? No. I guess in, in, a, in an attempt to sync them up, I'll wait a day maybe, but I think tomorrow I'm going to... Uh, Start refilling kegs. I just really don't want to wait any longer. I need that money. All right, let's go give Gus this diamond. Oh, I've already given Willie two gifts. All right. This will be good. So I'm hoping that on Gus's birthday. We'll max him out. Yes, we will. Yes, we will. We got nine hearts already. I just got to give him that loved gift on his birthday, and we should be good. Okay. Great. So now let's deal with... the. Yeah, I was going to go harvest wood. Um, I'm really kind of tempted to uh, just buy the iron and stuff that I need. I don't know that it's worth the time to... I mean, I'll harvest what I can for sure, but I don't know that it's totally worth the time. Um, 
to do anything else with it. Uh, let's also see if I can come up with enough... Uh... Hardwood to make one more heavy tapper. I don't think I'm going to be able to, but... Is that enough? I need 30. I wouldn't even get enough if I went to the secret wood, so I'm not going to bother. Okay, so let's... Uh, let's do some of this. Try swapping these guys out. Uh, I kind of want to have these guys be a bit closer, but... Oh, here's a tree without a tapper. There's one. And I'm going to assume that, like, this one was finished. Uh, okay. <clears throat> Two more heavy tappers. That's, that's, that's good news. Don't care. Uh, Alright, let's go up to the train station and just cut down trees till... I can't cut any more trees. Variant with the sub. Thank you for the sub, Variant. Thank you very much. I appreciate the 11 months of subs. Thank you so much, my friend. Hope you're doing well. Hope everything is good with you. Thank you so much. I haven't seen you around in a while. I was off. I took uh, I took a two-week vacation. So I have not been around for a while, which should explain that. Um, everything's doing good over here? Excellent. Good to hear. Just finished building a PC. Oh, do tell. Come on, give me a... There we go. That's what I want. Um... Give me, give me, give me the rundown. Give me the specs. Explains why I haven't seen you. Yes, that would explain why why you haven't seen me in at least two weeks. Simple desktop for my aunt. I five no GB. Oh, okay. I thought you'd built some like we built some crazy gaming machine or something. Did both those trees not get? Oh, there we go. Okay, I do have some pine cones. Yeah, I, I do often think that I'd like to build a new computer, but I just can't really justify the money, to be fair. I kind of need to decide what I want to do next with, like, my life, and purchase-wise. Grandma Gamer. Um, I need to decide what to do next, because... The dream of, of going to flight school is just not going to happen. Not anytime soon, anyways, because I definitely can't afford that. Um, what else? I was thinking, oh, maybe build a new PC, but I'm like, eh. Do I really want to do that? I don't know. I would almost, like, need need there to be a game I really wanted to play that really, whoops, that really needed to have a computer that's Whoops, that's a lot better than what I have. You know, honestly, I'm playing Stardew Valley right now, so... <laughs> Probably don't need that. Grab my MLG. Um, so yeah, I don't know. Grab my 360 no scopes noobs on the, on the daily and more so. I built my current PC so I could hit... Ray tracing, nice. I guess the question for me is what do I want to do with my computer next? Because I'm still not really doing any single thing, you know what I mean? Like I'm still, if I was, you know, for music, don't really need to have anything super crazy for music. Um, um, After that, not a whole lot of reasons upgrade for a while. Well, that was my thing. Like, I mean, this is like this computer that I work that I'm on right now. I built five years ago. Um, bought the best CPU I could find. At the time, it was uh, an i7 6700K. Um, you know, put a 980 Ti in it. Um. And it was that just built it so I could do VR. And so I mean, now I have VR headsets in the closet up there. I haven't even taken it out since we moved. So um, I was thinking about pulling it out again, though. With my 
my my dream of flying, I've kind of I'm on the flying kick right now. So I've been watching a bunch of videos about flying. I think I'm gonna like do some learning and just learn more about it. Um, there's some stuff I found that I might be able to kind of just learn form like l pro learn properly about how flying works and that sort of thing. Um, so I might do that. Um, which VR games did you play? No scary ones. <laughs> Mainly, um, Belgian Waffle. What VR games did I play? Belgian Waffle was at my house many times when I lived in the place I used to live. So we had, uh, we had some good times. Um, some, some of my favorite, I just enjoy like the simple ones. So like Space Pirate Trainer, super simple game, but I just really, really enjoyed that one. Um, I also enjoyed putting people through things like Just In Time Incorporated. That was a fun one. Um, other VR games like I don't even know what I even have. Hold on, let me have a look. Some of my favorite Black Hat Cooperative that was a fun one for two players. Budget Cuts was good. <clears throat> um, if you if you like some like psychological horror, Duck Season's a good one. I played a lot of Final Approach, which is kind of a goofy flying game, like where you're just like you draw paths for planes to go to to follow, and then you land them and take them off and get them to take off and land them or whatever. It's like your air traffic control almost. Uh, might be worth getting a hotas and playing DCS World or Project Wingman. Rabbit Season is one of the flight sims. Yes, that's what I've been thinking about doing. Instead of spending fifteen thousand dollars and buying or and getting my pilot's license, maybe I'll just spend like eighty bucks and buy Flight Simulator. Uh, I think it supports VR as well. So, um, so that would be good. Um, so I might do that. I'll have to see, and then that would that might give me the impetus to like pull out my. Uh, my VR headsets. Um, Carp surprise, nice. Uh, pull up my VR headset and, and use it. That might be a good thing. All right, I'm gonna grab, how many kegs do I even have right now? 209, okay, that should be enough of that. Um, just gonna throw this in there. Rather than pay 2000 for a helicopter ride, I just paid about 70 bucks, not including equipment, just to fly around an aisle to Sturmach. Nice. Yeah, I, uh, yeah. <clears throat> I was thinking about doing that too, actually. Well, not too, not a helicopter ride, but uh, an airplane ride. I was thinking about, um, I was thinking about doing it. There's a company that I, if I was going to, I could, uh, totally forgot to make um, the carp surprise. Where is it? What does it even look like? Um, <clears throat> yeah, I think there's a company that will do like a... Well, you can do... What do they call it? A, not a dem demonstration flight, but a... What's the flight where they... Like, if you're thinking about flying, they'll take you up and get you to fly around. And There's Carp Surprise. So take you up and get you to fly around and to see if you like flying. That. Uh, or just like an aerial tour. There's the there's company does aerial tours. So I was thinking about doing that. The problem is, a lot of fires around right now, so even if they were doing aerial tours, there may not be a lot to see. But, um... But, yeah. So there's that. Might do that at some point. I was talking last night about how I have my, my boating license as well. I was thinking about doing some boating. Um... Aerial tour of a fire sign me up. I was thinking about doing some, some boat stuff. And, uh... Keg. And, um, but like renting a boat for a day is like super expensive. <laughs> if I were to rent a boat for a day, it would be like, if I were to rent like a nice boat for a day, it'd probably, probably be, I think it was like 800 bucks. I found a place in town that'll rent me a boat for a day for 800 bucks. I hope that includes fuel. All right, let's pop over to the quarry. Sadly, None of these things are done, but whatever. What I'll basically do is... Um, we'll see how long it takes for the next batch to finish. This batch of kegs. But, uh, once this batch of kegs is... Once the next batch of kegs finishes... I will, 
do I wait the day or do I just go? I have I have no idea. I'm gonna grab this iron though. Thank you. Okay. Uh, quick stop by the mines as well, just to make sure I don't have anything here that I want to take home with me. I do not. Although I just picked up some iron ore. Ooh, just enough. Nice. Boop. Need a piece of coal. Boop. Nice. Could throw some more iridium. I need iridium ore. I need four iridium ore for something. Ooh, that means I can make two more iridium bars, though. There we go. Okay, back to the house. I don't have anything in the bus area, do I? No, okay. Doing the quarry first. Good idea. Anyway, so yeah, I'm trying to decide what I should do next for... Oh, hobbies. <laughs> I need cheaper hobbies. That's what it really comes down to. I need to, like, take up collecting dirt or something, something that's like really cheap. Okay. You know... I'm gonna put that in there. Alright. So, I need more hardwood. I should be able to make one more heavy tapper today, so let's do that. Let's go here. And you know what? Yeah, let's just go to the secret wood. Let's grab some more hardwood. Then I'll come back. We'll hit the, uh, grab the hardwood on the farm. That should be enough for at least one more. Anything here that I want? I'm pretty sure there isn't. Nope. I'm going back a bit easier. Anyway, so yeah. So many things that I had wanted to do, I'm kind of just like not doing. Like even buying new lights, like I wanted to get some new lights, new streaming lights, but I was like, eh. I think in my old, like when I was younger, I would have been like, absolutely, yeah, spend the money and whatever. But now I'm kind of like, do I really want to spend that money on that, on that frivolous thing? Although to be fair, I did buy a 360 camera did by this 360 camera. Um, <laughs> hopefully I'll actually finish the uh, the summer vacation video soon. Summer vacation clips. I was going to try and make an adventuring with Paul, but it's been so long since uh, I did any actual vlogging that I kind of like was a little bit out of my element and I was really tired when we were on the trips and stuff. I'm like, nah, forget, I can't be bothered. So I just, it's just going to be a bunch of clips. But, uh, but yeah, I'll, I'll get that done. I was hoping to finish it yesterday. Didn't. Thought I'd work on it today. Didn't. Um, but hopefully... Soon. I'll try to have it done, like, before next week or something. Do I still have the radioactive ore on me? I do. There's a heavy tapper. Nice. Okay, I will grab the rest of the... We'll grab the rest of the hardwood while I'm here. Nice, okay. Get rid of some of these extra seeds that are going to just grow up into things that are going to be in my way. Okay, since this tree over here finished, it finished, I think this guy here finished, uh, I think that was the day it finished the thing, so I'm going to put one next to it. I hate to, like, mess up if the stuff's already on the go, I hate to mess it up and kind of reset it, but having it in a convenient spot is kind of important to me right now. Okay, so, back inside the house. I really hope all this truffle oil is worth it, too. Like, I mean, in terms of time, like, hopefully the time I'm spending making all the truffle oil is still worth um, it was worth me taking the time to make the truffle oil. Okay. So, so there's 40 star fruit wine. That will be a huge help. Maybe I will go get that marble thing today. Um, what else am I selling? Sell those. 
So I think I might, I might do like a fiber. St I don't know if the fiber starter is worth it though. What's it called? The fiber fiber seeds. Where are the fiber seeds at? Here. Clay set. I guess you four seeds. Don't have to water it. Do I really want? I don't think it's worth it. Like, do I really want to have fiber that badly? Because the fiber it would be for. Oh, do I have to whole land for it too? Weak. Yeah, it's probably not worth it. Because I would just be getting the fiber for tree fertilizer. So that the trees up by the train station grow faster. Is that really worth doing? I don't know that it is. Okay, let's go see Clint. Let me drop off some inventory stuff here. Um, I'll keep like 100 sap, just in case. I will keep the fiber. Leave the hardwood and the regular wood in there. I will... What else will I do? Can drop off my seeds. Ah, crap. All right, I messed up my geodes. Uh, all right, geodes are here, so I need a marble. I think it's 12 I need to crack in total. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. 12 in total. Number 12 needs to be a frozen. Number 10 needs to be, let's say, magma. So I've got five. Great. Uh, that's five. <clears throat> One of those. That's six. And six of those. All right. Let's go see. Let's stop by here first. Let's sell the mahogany. Sell the sap. Uh, let's put the carp surprise in there. And let's go see Clint. I, mm, I wish I remembered when the stuff on Ginger Island was going to finish. That's kind of not great. Alright, Clint. Let's process some geodes. So, let us begin. So I just said 10 needs to be magma, 12 needs to be frozen. Everything else doesn't matter. 2 3 4 I think I have all the gems too, right? 5. I think I have all, all like the minerals in uh in the museum. 6 7 <clears throat> 8 9 That should be some iridium. I'll take it. 11 and this should be the marble I need. Beautiful. And I need that so I can make myself a marble brazier. Uh, which is here. I need 100 stone, 1 marble, 1 aquamarine. Alright, let's go up to the mine. Oh, I already checked that garbage can, never mind. And let's throw in, I mean, I've got uh, that. Grab that. Uh, okay... there and let me just grab a slab of much stone make the marble brazier oops bam that's all the braziers made sweet uh let's mark it off my list that is right there beautiful it is, it is coming together did i not make an ostrich incubator hmm. it's coming together uh, i made fairy dust i'm quite certain yeah i did Bang, fairy dust. Um, oh, no. I'm screwed. I didn't realize you don't get the recipe for casks until you finished upgrading the house. But that final house upgrade costs 100000 150 hardwood, 50,000, and I just burned through hard... Crap. 
I might be boned. I gotta get the house done. I have to get the house done immediately. Uh, back to bus stop. Alright, let me see what I have for hardwood. Um, because I need, what, 150? Yeah, um, yeah, that was a, a cock up. Alright. What do I have for hardwood? 74. Been making heavy tappers. I had enough, but I've been making heavy tappers. Whoops. Okay, well, let's sell some of this stuff. And I will hang on to the clay and I'll get rid of some stuff in here. Mm, that's rather unfortunate. Okay, so, I mean, whatever. No use crying over spilled milk. Um, literally nowhere else. I, I mean, I guess I could go to Ginger Island. Yeah, let's go to Ginger Island. Why not? Let's just put this marble brazier right here at the set, the thing in the farm. And let's just go to Ginger Island. Let me take a gift for Leo. I think I've missed Leo's birthday already. Uh, summer 26, I have not missed Leo's birthday, so I need to keep a loved gift for his birthday. So, but we will go to Ginger Island. Do I have all the... All the... All the walnuts? No, I don't. Alright, let me grab my watering can, then we'll go to Ginger Island. Might spend the night there, we'll see. Uh, I'll take the Galaxy Soul with me as well. Anything else I can go to Ginger Island? Um... What else goes to Ginger Island? I might just warp to the beach, actually. It'll save me a few, a few minutes. What else needs to go to Ginger Island? A scythe. A scythe can go to Ginger Island. Um, don't think I need anything else. I don't think. Three prizzies? I don't think I need three. I might need one on Ginger Island. Or maybe I did that. I might have done that already, actually. I might have already upgraded my... Yeah, I already upgraded my hammer with the prismatic shard, I think. Um... Yeah, that should be fine. Should be fine. Alright, here we go. No idea why I have the pancakes on me. But, you know, whatever. Should have brought a gift for Willie. I'm not going to give Willie a gift, right? I'll talk to him. But I'm not going to give him a gift because... Um... I'd rather give him the loved gifts. I'm getting closer with Willie, so... I kind of want to give him the... As many loved gifts as possible. Unfortunately for Leo, I got nothing, so... Leo gets an apricot. If I see him somewhere. He's not there. I may as well find him. Because, uh... To be fair... I'm here for hardwood, so... Let's see if he's at home. Oh, there he is. Okay. Let's head back to the farm. Grab some hardwood. I need 150 for the next house upgrade, I believe. Yeah, the, uh, yeah. I mean, the, the good news is I should be able to I'll, I'll at least be able to get... Even if I don't have all the money... Uh, even if I don't have all the money I need to finish the challenge, I better have everything else done. So... Yeah, that's kind of my, uh... I battle cry right now. Maybe I should have come out here tomorrow, because actually I might just spend the, the night here, because I think Monday I get new I get new quests on a Monday, so. How much is that? 33. Could be worse. Not ideal, but not the you know, not not terrible. You know, as far as terrible goes. Okay, so the this stuff is coming along pretty well. 
All right, what am I dropping off? Scythe, finally. Um, Galaxy Soul. Uh, drop all the tarot tubers. Let's sell some stuff. Let's sell them. Sap, hauling seeds, bananas, fossilized ribs, slime. Looks good. Um, okay, I guess I'm going to head over to the mine now. Or the volcano. Yeah, just head to the volcano. See if I can get that last golden walnut. Really low on food, though. That's a little bit sketchy. How about... I guess I'm eating salmon berries and apricots. I have enough of them. Maybe I'll get some magma caps as well. Hopefully I'll find some magma caps in the volcano. This will max out again. At least max out my health, if nothing else. That should do it, hopefully. Yeah. Alright, to the volcano. So I'm looking for, I'm trying to break barrels is what I'm trying to do. There's one more golden walnut to get. Wait a second. Is there one more golden walnut I'm trying to get? I should have checked at the walnut room. This might be a complete waste of time. Hopefully I get lucky early. Oh, I need to kill more baddies, though, too. Like these guys. I kill a bunch of those guys. That was a waste. Oops, it's coming to get me. Alright. Really hoping I find... These tiger slimes are... Not my favorite. Uh, really hoping I get this. See, I'm a little bit worried because the first time I did a perfection challenge, um, th the game glitched. Something glitched where I had found all of the walnuts, but for some reason the save file didn't agree. So I ended up having to like manually edit the save file um, so that I could... Uh, I had to manually edit the save file to tell the game, yes, I have found all the walnuts. So I know, I think I know where it happened too. Like, I think I'm, I kind of know, um, there's a particular walnut that you can't see. It's, it's on the farm area. Um, and if you, uh, kind of, yeah, I kind of like follow this, this path up in the, in the corner. Can't really see what's going on. Whoops, that's the wrong tool. Um, yeah, and I, I remember going up the path to get the walnut, and I hadn't had the walnut before, but it didn't make it, it made it look like I didn't, like, it didn't, I go I go up to the bush, I hit the bush, but it didn't actually give me a walnut, so I, and I know I hadn't been there before, so I think that's the one that kind of glitched out. There's the walnut. Yes, all right. Uh, what level are we at? Level two. Let's go back the way we came. I should keep going, actually. I might get some more iron or something. Anyways, that's what happened. Um, it was quite sad. Um, but yeah, what do you do? Ooh, there's a chest there, actually. That could be good. I kind of want to get both those guys coming after me so I can deal with them before I go over here. Whoops. Okay, all right. Watering can. Just want to open that up. Tower tuber is totally not worth it. Completely. Oh, there's another one though. Let's see if this one will break my heart. Don't know why I did that. I also need to watch my health. My health is a little bit on the low side. Bro, I'm just gonna eat this magma cap. There we go. Right, 
that blow up. There we go. Oops. Dragon tooth cutlass? What? What is what? What is this? No way. 75 to 90 damage. Tower of Tubers per Terror Terror. So it does this does more damage on average than my Galaxy Hammer, even though my Galaxy Hammer's been upgraded. And it has a plus 50 crit power. Okay, I need to get need to get used to the timing of it again. I need to eat something. I'm gonna take damage again here no matter what happens, so I may as well just keep eating. Like that, there we go. Wow, Dragon Tooth Cutlass. I've never, I didn't even know, didn't even know this existed. And that's OP too, that's like, super powerful. That's like scary powerful. I'm tempted to see if I can upgrade this actually, because that'd be really sweet. Okay, there's some lovely iron and some lovely copper. Oh, there's some lovely iridium. I was hoping that guy was going to explode and uh, um, and hit the uh, the guy that was flying by there. Sadly, it did not happen that way. Okay, well that was kind of sweet. Um, curiosity lure. Not super useful to me anymore. Okay, let's leave the volcano. That was sweet. A dragon tooth cutlass. With plus 50 crit power. So I mean, that's like... I wonder if I have enough cinder shards to, en to just try enchanting it with anything. Uh, let's go back to the farm and see what we've got. I don't think I have anything to enchant it with. I want to use a prismatic shard, but they're all back at home, back on the farm. Um, got some more of that. That's good. Uh, let's dump some more of that stuff in there. I don't have I don't have any cinder shards now. All right, that's too bad. Keep that in mind, though. That that could be super sweet. Uh, the dragon tooth, though. I still need 10 of those. I bet you I don't have 10 of those. Uh, okay, let's sell the bone fragment. I think I have 100 bone fragments. Sell the sap. Sell the slime. Sell the white algae and the pineapple seeds. And kind of want to keep everything else, I think. Uh, do I go to bed? Do I do anything else? I guess I could maybe go see if there's any um, panning spots at the dig site. Sometimes there are. Oh, there's one. Come on, luck ring. Still have never had a luck ring in this game. And still don't. But I got some uh, some iron, so I can't complain. Alright, let's just uh, let's get let's, let's, let's get a bid. <clears throat> um farm. So next tomorrow's Monday in game. <clears throat> I think it's Gus's birthday. Yes it is. Uh, so we need to make sure we give Gus that gift, max out Gus's friendship. We'll give Leo a gift before we leave as well. We'll check the Chi room, confirm that we have all the golden walnuts. And, um... <clears throat> see what else we can do. Okay, there's 130,000. That's going to pay for my, my next house upgrade. I wonder how long the trees take to grow back. I still need more hardwood. It's also rather unfortunate that I, um, that I don't have something. What was the thing I don't, it's unfortunate I don't have? Can't remember. Okay, never mind. So, just ignore that. 
quick check in here, check these. Wait, I don't need any of these anymore. I do not want to reset the mine right now, so forget that. All right, walnuts found, yes. And we, so we've got all the fish, we've got all the walnuts, we hit all of the farming levels. So good, we only have two more things left to ship. The big thing is cooking, but I mean cooking you have to wait, and we're only halfway there on friendship, so. If I can pull off the money, we'll be all right. All right, let's go back to the farm. And, oh, no, let's give Leo a gift first. Maybe I'll grab the farm totem I have here. Uh, where is it? There it is. Grab one of those. Yeah, I guess I want to take back. I might just sell these taro tubers. Can't sell that. Don't think I can sell bobbers. Um, anything else I want to leave here? Don't think so. I may as well leave that here because I can't do anything with it. Okay, let's go find Leo. And, uh... See if that is place. We'll go find Leo, and then we will head back to the farm. Check the questing board. It's probably something I'm going to need. <clears throat> I think there's still, yeah, there's still recipes I don't have, so there's going to be something that I need for sure. Everything okay? Yes, everything is fine. Bye, Felicia. Alright. <clears throat> oh, we have more oak resin. Very nice. Give me all of the oak resins. Just give me so much oak resin. Okay, so that's 17. That's good. Um... I feel like I just put stuff in the kegs yesterday. <clears throat> so I feel like I could potentially get, if I can come up with 17 more kegs, um, I feel like that might be worth doing, getting them over into the quarry and uh, Getting them into the, getting the kegs into the quarry and putting stuff in them. Um, I definitely don't have 17 iron bars, which isn't great, but uh, you know what, whatever. Oh, I need to swing by the greenhouse as well, actually. I bet you my coffee beans are done. Put those in there. And while I'm here, let's grab another one of those. And those are done there too as well. Okay, that's good to know. So let's do that. It's only a day off. So let's grab some of that. Grab as much iron as I've got. I've got six. That's not great. Uh, it is Monday. I want to give Gus a tropical curry. I'm going to keep that on me so I don't forget. Um, let me just clear out my bit of inventory here. Um, I'm going to leave my galaxy sword behind. I guess the hammer is still useful because you can slam it, so that's kind of useful, the multi-hit thing. But that dra dragon tooth cutlass, though. Whew, man, that's hot. Okay, <clears throat> let's leave the, that behind as well. No, I still have a tapper on me for some reason. Um, I guess I could probably find a tree to put it on. Actually, yeah, let me go. I can go put it on a tree up at the uh, train station. That in there. Let's get rid of... Let's just start getting rid of stuff. Ooh, that's a lot of stuff. Uh, 114 hardwood. So we're actually close with the house upgrade. We are close with the house upgrade. So I'm going to try and come up with 11 more blocks of iron. I mean, I've got six there. That's 12. So five, 30 more. No, five there. No, six. 25. So I don't actually... I might be able to pull out today, actually. I might get away with it. Potentially. Um, must give Gus a gift. Uh, let's deal with... That was bad. That was a bad way of doing that. I'll put that in there. I'm going to sell these tower tubers. But first, before I forget again, let's go to the... Grab that. Let's go to the greenhouse and grab 
anything in here that needs to get grabbed. There we go. Red cabbage is getting real close. Lovely, and grab all the coffee beans. Great. Okay, back to the house. We'll get some coffee on the go. Uh, what else will we do? While I'm on my way and thinking about it, let me throw those in there. Uh, okay, let's get some coffee going, and then we need to go... I don't think I would quite get enough hardwood today if I harvested everything. I don't think I would quite get enough to do the house upgrade. I don't think I'd get to 150. Um, so I'm not going to worry about that just now. <laughs> I should probably stop filling up my kegs with non-coffee related things. Okay, uh, so let's... Um, Need to swing by Gus. And uh, you know what? I should get to the mine right away. I should do that. Because I need to make sure that I get the iron that I need and get it smelting and everything and stuff. Need to make sure I get that. Now, do I have enough wood for 17 kegs? Three, 300. And 210. If I don't. I'm like, but I'm only like 20 wood short, so we should be okay. That's gonna be easy to get. Alright. To the mine. Let's get some iron going. Let's get some coal first. Grab a bunch. What 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 what? Oh yeah, okay. I'm like, wait, 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 what's going on? I have all the iron. Okay, so we've got six going. I've got seven. That's 13. I need four more. Let's go get some iron. Hopefully it's a good luck day. Ooh, actually, hardwood. <laughs> Maybe I will have enough hardwood today. That'd be sweet. But of course, I have to actually get the hardwood and get to Robin before she closes. So that may not be as easy as all that. Okay, I do see some iron off in the distance. That is why I'm here. Let's grab it. Try to avoid this bad guy. I don't have to worry about him. How much do I need? I think I need four more. Well, let's try and get 20. Halfway there. I uh, clearly, since I can't see a thing, <clears throat> well, I guess I should be taking screenshots, but oh, hardwood. Yes. I'm actually kind of sad that I haven't been uh, seeing a lot of radioactive ore lately. Is that enough? Oh, I'm so. Oh, that's enough. Okay, great. So, here's what we're going to do grab all that. Grab that. Grab that. That gives me 22 hardwood, which is actually sweet. Just gotta quickly check here. I do see some more hardwood. I'm just gonna grab it while I'm here. Okay. Let's go back up top. Let's put in four, that's 13, that's 17. No idea how my math was quite that wrong. Still, um, so I need, oh no, that's 17, that's as many as I need. Okay, so 34, you know what, I might be able to get enough hardwood. If I just go grab all of it. Oh, I can make another uh, 
another one of those as well. Let's make another iridium bar. Delete lots of iridium bars, which is a little bit scary because I'm really bad at getting iridium. Okay, let's go back to the bus stop. Let's swing by the crib. So now the plan, <laughs> while we wait for the iron to smelt, is to get as much hardwood as possible. That's, I have no idea what I grabbed there. Oh, I only need two more. Oh, we're, we got this in the bag. All right, here we go. House upgrade, here we come. I am doing this right, yeah? Cask, farmhouse. I've got the first upgrade. This one is 50,000, 150 hardwood. Next one's just cash. All right, so this is, this is like the last, the last thing I have to worry about. Is Robin at home on a Monday? I hope Robin's at home on a Monday. All right, let's go see if Robin's at home on a Monday. I should check for... <gasps> yes, duck feathers. Still looking for that rabbit's foot, but... Hopefully, I will eventually... We need to swing by Gus as well. Let's go to Robin. I'm not worried about Gus. Let's just... We gotta make sure we catch Robin. Then we'll swing by the mine. Um, we have to catch Robin. Then we'll swing by the mine. Finish up with the kegs. Then we'll swing by the quarry. And actually finish up with the kegs. What up, Robin? Upgrade my hoose. Thank you. Nice. Okay, that's good. Um, <clears throat> so we'll swing by the mine now. We'll, and then the quarry, and we'll deal with all the keg stuff. And then we'll go see gas, and then we'll figure out what we're doing after that. Could even do a bit more gifting, or... Whatever. It's not done yet. Crazy. Uh, well, let's give... I'm pretty sure I have a, a gift for the dwarf in here somewhere. Whoops. Um... I don't. So... <laughs> oh, never mind, they're done. Sweet. Alright, make me... 17... Ah. Wood. Crap. Right, I forgot about the wood. Alright, let's uh, <clears throat> get a bit more wood. Inventory's full. Uh, let's cut this down. That should be enough for the 17th keg. Very nice. All right. Let's just go this way. Put down the other 17 kegs. And, uh... Ooh. More, more star things are done. This is excellent. And eight more of these. Come on. There we go. Is nice. All right. This is perfect. Ooh, is it perfect though? I only brought 119 star fruit. May not be perfect. We'll see what happens. Hopefully I have enough. Now is when we're really gonna start making some money. Whoops, I should have gone down this way. Now we're really going to start making some money. So all these... Forgot to line these kegs up properly. Um, and yeah, as all these kegs finish... Um, we're going to start getting paid. Alright, sweet. So now, next thing we're going to do, back to the house. <clears throat> I know I said we we're gonna go see Gus, but I lied. Back to the house so I can f replace the star fruit in the kegs at home. And then in theory, all of my kegs should be synced up within a day of each other. That's the hope. All right, let's go put some more coffee beans in. Nice. Got an ancient fruit wine, for whatever reason. Um, okay, give me a try. I have a truffle. Oh, right, I have the ancient fruit wine because I had ancient fruit. I have an ancient fruit plant. May as well make it into ancient fruit wine. 
Okay. Drop that there. Sell 81. That's going to be worth a couple hundred thousand. Sell that. I don't have a prehistoric skull? Dang. Uh, sell the truffle oil. Sell the mahogany seeds. She's going to sell the spice berries. Sell the duck mayonnaise. Sell the slime. She's going to sell the sap. Uh, keeping the rest of it. Uh, okay, so, actually, before I forget... Uh, hardwood. I need 53 hardwood. I've got 8. Could be worse. Oh, crap, it's 520, so I cannot get into the museum now. That's unfortunate. Yeah, I don't think... What time is the museum open until? I don't, I don't think it's open after past 5. Just on the off chance it's open until 6 or something random. Pretty sure it isn't, but... Oh, I, I'm in. Sweet. It's a good thing I checked. There we go. So there's, I think we're, all, I think we're only missing three things, aren't we? We're super close with the, uh, with the artifacts and stuff. So the minerals, we have all of them. Artifacts, two. <clears throat> I need the prehistoric scapula and the cracked pot thing. Um, let me let's see how I can get those. I might, I wonder if I should just chipped amphora, three percent chance in town on artifact trove. And the prehistoric scapula. Bone nodes. So I should just be cracking bone nodes um, on Ginger Island. That might be enough. I don't know what the chance is, but... Forest through town. So, so yeah, basically forest and town. Okay. And then this one. Artifact trove. I wonder... Oh, hold on, let me have a look at the predictor. Uh, let me reload this. Look at geodes. We have done that. Okay. Uh, so artifact trove. Oof. Oof. Oh wait, hold on. No, chip down four. How much one I bad? I just I just missed one. Yep. If I had done it the right way, I would have been able to have that one in there already. Fine. Uh, so I've got, but there is a chipped M4 right. I think I saw one here, right there. 244. So I need to crack like 20 geodes, and I can get one if I have an artifact trove. And I get an artifact trove from the desert trader um, for five omnis. Totally worth it. Okay, this is good. So basically. I'm super close with the museum. I only have two things left to donate. Um, one of them's in the bag, just with geodes, and the other one, hopefully I just get lucky. Okay, let's go see Gus. And uh, <clears throat> give him his birthday gift, which is the tropical curry. Let's check this one as well. So, Willy wants 100 pieces of bug meat. And he also wants tropical fish. All right, let's check quests. These are the special orders provided by William. Ooh, juicy bugs wanted 100 bug meat. Quality baba recipe. I need that. I think. Do I need that? Do I need that? Yeah, I do. Okay. Bug meat it is. Okay. Bug meat. Must get bug meat. And you have to collect them while the quest is active. I don't have a diamond for Maru. Happy birthday, Gus. That max out Gus? Yeah, it did. Beautiful. All right, Gus can come off my friendship list. Sweet deal. Okay, who's my next like big target on my friendship list? Pierre. Oh, Willie. I'm super close with Willie, actually. Give Willie some meat, that'll cover that. Crobus is going to be pretty... Oh, yeah, I should maybe do some gifting, get some gifting gifting out of the way. I gotta go... Um, <clears throat> yeah, let's do that. Here's what we're going to do. I'm going to go grab some gifts. Uh, I need to go into the, the sewer anyways to get some, some bug meat. Slay two ghosts. And eh, I'm not going to bother. I already have max friendship with the wizard, so I'm not going to worry about that. Uh, so yeah, I do need to, I need the bug meat, and I can get a bunch of bug meat in the sewer, so 
Let me grab some. Let me grab a gift for Krobus. Super close with Krobus, which is awesome. All right, so let's. Uh, let me. Let's. 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 What am I doing? What am I doing? Drop that stuff in there. What else can I drop off? I've got a duck feather for the gift. I've got one beads bug meat. Doesn't really, doesn't really help me. Alright, let's drop that in there, drop those in there. Just want to try and clean out my inventory as much as possible. Okay. Oh, there's some mead. I can give that to Willie. He should be at the saloon this evening. Uh, some more triple shot, which is good. Um, oh, some, some more coffee. The rest of these should finish any second, right? There they go. Very nice. Okay. So, we're going to take a mead for Willy. We're going to take a void egg for Krobus. Give him a gold star. Uh, take a few diamonds with me, just in case. Got apricots. Um, I don't think I'm going to find Jazz. Might find Shane, but I've maxed out Shane, haven't I maxed out Shane? I have not maxed out Shane. Alright, let's take that for Shane. If I see Haley, if I I will see Emily. I'm gonna see the dwarf as well. I uh, might see Sebastian. Take a couple more diamonds. Don't think I'm gonna see Caroline. I'll leave I'll leave that. Um That should be pretty good. Yeah, let's go with that. Oh, and I might see Harvey, just in case I see Harvey. I probably won't. I don't think he leaves leaves home on a Monday, but let's grab that for Harvey. Okay. Let's see how lucky I get with finding people. <clears throat> so we've given... So we've maxed out Gus. That's awesome. Um, want to make sure I give... For sure give Willie a gift. For sure give Krobus a gift. Maru's probably gone already. He's probably gone home. Dang it. I haven't been gone that long, but maybe I can catch her before she goes in the house. Bit of a waste of time doing this, but whatever. At some, at some point, I am going to have to pull the trigger and, and marry this girl. So, there she is. Come into my room if you ever want to tinker with my gadgets. Okay, so, um, for sure Willy, for sure, um, Krobus. Willy is not here. There's Shane, though. No, don't try to give him a gift. There we go. Uh, Emily. Wait, haven't I maxed out Emily? I have maxed out Emily. Yeah, I have. Okay, never mind. Let's see if we can find Willy before I go. Into the sewer. Let's give this to Elliot. I thought Willy for sure would be going to the... Uh, Oh, there he is. Uh, Willie gets some mead. Alright, how close are we with Willie now? Nine. Hopefully the next one will do it. Uh, so, all those people are maxed out. Willie's super close. Krobus, we're going to give a love. Sam, we're done with Sam. Krobus, Jazz, I have a pink cake for Jazz. Emily and Leah are maxed out. I have some green tea for Caroline. Uh, hopefully we can max out Shane pretty soon, too, actually. And Maru. This is really good. <laughs> the more I can get these friendship things done, the less I'll have to spend time doing them. Which is fantastic. So let's now go to... If I could... Yeah, no, I'm not going to bother trying to catch Penny now. It's 9.30. And I want to get some bug meat. So let's go see Krobus. Give Krobus this lovely thing right here. There you are, Krobus. I want to buy anything here from here. 
the return scepter. Oh, man, the return scepter would be super useful. It's a real shame that uh, can't afford it. I do have a burglar ring on, right? Yes, okay, good. Burglar ring is going to be helpful in this quest to get the meat. Because I need all of the bug meats. Because how many is that so far? Four. I wonder... I don't know if it would be better... Get back here, get back here. Oh, crap, I missed it. There we go. Wonder if it would be better for me to put the mine back to the regular mine to get buck meat. There is the raid from Only Bananas. Because why not? Thank you very much for the raid, Only Bananas. I see you are also playing Stardew Valley. Welcome in everybody from Only Bananas stream. Uh, welcome. My name is Paul. I'm a variety streamer. I do a lot of music streams, but uh, at the moment, as you can probably tell, I am uh, doing the Stardew Valley Challenge run. It's going... Yeah. Um, hello, Yoshkosh. Hello, oh, Only Bananas. Thank you very much for the raid. Hello, Mega Smiley Fish. Hello, Give Me Tendies Mommy. How is everybody doing? I hope you're all doing well. How, what are you up to in Stardew Valley, Only Bananas? Or are you just playing Stardew Valley like a normal human being and not playing it like I'm playing it? Uh, Alright, let's go to... While you're answering that question... Totally forgot to go give something to Haley. She's probably asleep right now. So I probably can't give her a coconut. Nope. Um... You never act like a normal human being. I finally beat Prairie King today. Congratulations. That is awesome. And thank you... Uh, oh, something happened. Thank you, Yoshko, for the follow. Appreciate that. Um, congratulations, quite frankly. Congratulations to you for beating Journey of the Prairie King. Good lord. Wow. I have... I, 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 yeah. I tried it once. I think I died on the first on the first level. And that's the end of the story. It's a very, very short, sad story. Um, but yeah, good for you for getting that done. Wow. That's, like, legit impressive. Thanks to some grinding to get that final boss down. Oh, are you kidding me? For sure. Thank you, Only Bananas, for the follow as well. Um, and thank you, Give Me Tendy's Mommy, for the follow. Thank you all very much. Appreciate that. 12.40, do I, should I go to the mine now? I'm tempted to go to the mine right now. What goals do you have as Stardew? Uh, this is just perfection in two years in-game, so um, I'm in, this is summer of year two. Things are going fairly well. Um, your mic audio is super clean and you have fantastic stream quality. Thank you very much. Um, I'm old. So, I guess that's not really strictly relevant, but and thank you, Mega Smiley Fish, for the follow. Um, it's the music stream stuff. Um, kind of is it definitely is influences that. Um, what am I doing? I have no idea. Um, yeah. So I think the challenge is going pretty well. Um, I should be able to do it. In theory, the big challenge—the big challenge in this challenge—is going to be the money, because I'm not very good at like doing things that make money, like Skull Cavern runs or like playing Stardew Valley. So, if I can come up with enough kegs, in theory, it might be okay. Uh, if I can't, then I'm screwed. So that's 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 really all it comes down to. It is purely a question of whether or not I can come up with enough kegs in time that's where i'm at so uh like right now i have a half a million so because so, you need to have you know let's actually let's let's take a formal look at this here let's take a proper look wizard's tower okay 
So we need to purchase all of these things. So this is not a Junimo hut. Uh, the gold clock, 10, 11, 12, we need 13 million gold to buy all the things. Um, I have not bought any of it yet. Like right now in game I have, oh, actually I just made 250,000. So right now in game I have, let's have a look. How much money do I have? Wait for it. Right now in game I have 800,000. So, that's not really enough. That's that's not even remotely be enough. Um, so, like, I'm almost... I'm going to probably get the Island Obelisk first, so that's going to be my first thing. But, um, yeah, the big thing is going to be, am I going to have enough? I have Ginger Island filled with starfruit, which is great. Um, I have um, a bunch of starfruit on my farm currently, which is also great. And I have a lot of star fruit right here that just is waiting for kegs. So we're talking about, you know, 200, 350, three or 400 star fruit there, plus some rhubarb I can throw in kegs if I have time. Um, plus, you know, I'll do some pumpkins in the fall on this farm. Um, I mean, fingers crossed, right? So yeah, that's basically where I'm at. Uh, things are going pretty well. Like, I have all my skills maxed out. That's fine. I've got all the golden walnuts. That's great. Um, I have all the recipes purchased from What's-His-Face, Mr. Chi, which is great. Um, the friendship's coming along really well. Um, we're close with Willy. We're close with Crobus. We're close with Pierre. We're close with Jazz. Um, golden walnuts. Go Spoiler alert. Um, sorry, I'm close with Maru, who I'm planning on marrying, which I should probably do sometime not too far away from now. I mostly just play with my buddies and try to steal their lo steal their love interests. <laughs> nice. Apparently there's a thing where if you romance all the females, because you can give bouquets to whoever you want, right? Like you can give a bouquet to anyone you have eight hearts with, any of the single people you have eight hearts with. So there's like a cutscene apparently where if you give a whole bunch of people or everybody all the female characters bouquets and you're dating all of them there is a cutscene where they're all like hey why, why, what the heck why are you trying to date all of us uh, but yeah the friendship's coming along nicely Leo and Kent I'm concerned about but flip I don't know uh, so yeah that's kind of things are kind of like <laughs> it's, a little, it's a little bit sketch right now but hopefully I can pull it off Hopefully it all comes together in the end. And if it doesn't, then I'll be very sad. Um, okay, let's do some... What am I doing today? Uh, well, let's, let's check for... I need to check for... Ra I really need a rabbit's foot. That's what I need the most. I'm going to keep petting this rabbit. No, no rabbit's foot. Really need a rabbit's foot. Oh, we got more oak resin. that lovely my double speed thingies are paying off oh my uh, okay this is good this is good um can replant some star fruit in here let's do that right now but yeah this perfection and two-year challenge is a whole thing oh i guess perfection is I mean, you mentioning perfection is also a spoiler if you're, if you're not familiar with golden walnuts just um so with the 1.5 update that came out earlier this year, a um, bunch of new content. Uh, definitely, definitely play it. Um, basically, get the community center done, and uh, then you know, carry on from there with stuff that will be available to you. That will be, that will become apparent. Uh, okay, we have some red cabbage. That's good. We have artichoke, which is also good. Um, that means I'm done shipping stuff. <gasps> yeah, I ship one artichoke, one red cabbage, and yeah, no, we're, we're good. Oh my word, that's, <laughs> that's so awesome. I don't think I've ever done that before. I don't think I've ever, like, 
successfully shipped everything. I haven't played the game since multiplayer came out. A lot of new content since multiplayer came out. All right, bam! Artichoke and red cabbage are done. We finished the shipping. That's so good. All right, inside the house, let's, uh, so many new cool things added. Yeah, there really is. There's a lot of good stuff. Okay, uh, there should be, there may or may not be a new recipe that I have access to that I have not yet cooked. Fish taco. Bam. There's fish taco done. This, in case you're wondering what this, what this is here, this is my perfection tracker. Uh, let's go back to the start page here and look at this one. So essentially, uh, you know what, let's actually do this. Let's go back and create a new one. Let's call it test. Okay, so I made this website um, to track basically everything that you need in terms of items that you can gather um, to accomplish perfection in the game. So one of the new things only bananas is there's things that can call perfection. A whole bunch of things you have to do, but they include, but are not, are not limited to, um, crafting all the items, cooking all the items, shipping all the items, that sort of thing, catching all the fish. So that's what this website is. This website I, that I made, that I taught myself how to do a lamp stack and program it, um, helps me keep track of everything I've shipped, all the fish I've caught, all the bundles I've done, all of the, um, you know, the various quests, the story quests, um, everything you shipped, uh, crafting and cooking, whatever else. And on this side over here is where it tells me. So in total, you need to have 61 bat wings. You might want more than that for other things, but you need 61 bat wings to be able to take care of all the recipes and everything else. So as I mark things off here, so right now, for example, uh, let me see if I can come up with a good example here. Let's look, let's go for lobster. So right here, it says you need four lobster. Um, and there is a story quest to get a lobster. So when I hit this checkbox right here, now this lobster becomes three. It disappears off this list, and now lobster becomes three. So it just helps me keep track of uh, of um, the items that I need. Um, let me get rid of that test game now. Delete, and here. So yeah, as you can see, this is this is all I have left in terms of items that I need. Bat wings? Nah. <laughs> um, so yeah, super cool. Uh, I'm going to mark fish cakes. I did already. Uh, or fish fish taco. I did already. Fish taco's done so good. Uh, pancakes, glazed yams. I'm actually just, let me just review everything and make sure there's nothing I'm missing at all here. That's done, that's done. It's all looking good. I'm pretty sure somebody loves pancakes. I could give pancakes to somebody. What's that complete breakfast? What is that? Oh, I think it's hash browns, doesn't it? Cause I, I think that's something Alex loves. Fried egg, hash browns, pancake. I don't think I have any potatoes, do I? No, I don't. Okay, so power rubbers, bread. Don't have that recipe yet. Rhubarb pie. Sweet, a little scary that I hadn't made that. Rhubarb pie is complete. Uh, cookies, spaghetti. Anything else that I've not made? I have not made a red plate. Beautiful. That's off my list. So, oh, hold on. A couple things here. Spicy eel. No, I've made that. Never mind. Sashimi. Okay, so everything on this page that I can make, I have made. So whatever that is, that's probably... What is that? Is that pink cake? Might be pink cake. I don't have the recipe for that yet. A lot of min-maxing. Yeah. <laughs> or it would be if I was good at it. Right now, it's just a little bit of min-maxing. Hopefully, it's enough min-maxing. Um... Artichoke dip. Bam! Oh my goodness. We're getting through this. Triple shot, obviously. Cranberry candy. Coleslaw. Do I have room for this in my inventory? <laughs> yes, coleslaw is done. This is so good. Uh, what else? That's poppy seed muffin. I don't have the recipe for that yet. Done that. So I think I am caught up. So everything that I can make, I've made. Sweet. Now what I should probably do is see what I need now for red cabbage. Officially, I don't need any red cabbage. I need one artichoke for something. What is the thing I need an artichoke for? 
Time for bed for me. Peace out. Have a nice rest of your night. Thanks very much, Only Bananas, for stopping in. Thank you for the follow and for the rain and all that good stuff. Have a great night. Hope to see you again. Uh, okay, so super meal. I only get when I reach seven hearts with Kent. Is there anything I can do to get going with Kent faster? Fiddlehead risotto. That's end of fall. That's not super useful. Roasted hazelnuts. Needs hazelnuts, which I don't have. So soon I'll be able to do a little bit, but not really a lot, which is unfortunate. Okay, um... All right, let me just get rid of some stuff. Got a bunch of food. Uh, let me drink that. Speed things up a little bit. Okay, so artichoke dips, regular food. Coleslaw is regular food. Red plate, fish taco. I wonder if it's, I think, I feel like somebody loves a fish taco, don't they? Does somebody love a fish taco? Line? No. Caroline Caroline loves a fish taco. I might give Caroline a fish taco. And then what does Pierre love? I think he loves weird stuff. Just fried calamari? Pierre, don't be such a... Pierre. Mm. Okay, so let's give Caroline a fish taco. Let's do some gifting. Let's do some gifting. So, with the rhubarb pie there, let me sell the rest of my red cabbage and sell my... Artichoke. I can grow more if I need them, so I'm not going to worry about it. I can make three more kegs. Maybe I won't worry about that today. Maybe I'll just do some gifting here. So, pink cake for Jazz. Poi. Who loves a poi? Is that... Uh, I feel like that's Leo. Yeah, you get the recipe from Leo. Yeah, that's right. Okay. I should really take that to Ginger Island, actually. And the duck feather. Okay, so uh, let's give Willie some mead. We've got, uh, okay, let's get this organized here. Oh, ancient fruit. I'm going to put the ancient fruit in a keg inside the house, I think. There we go. Every little bit helps. Okay, so. Um, gifts. Caroline. Harvey. Sebastian. Um, the dwarf. Don't need to gift Emily. Willie, uh, Jazz, um, let me get rid of the grape, and let me get rid of the amethyst as well. Um, so just out of curiosity, I have 16 amethysts there. Amethyst. <clears throat> Abigail, Clint, the Dwarf, and Emily. Have I maxed out Abigail yet? No, that's who I'm giving it to. I've maxed out Emily. I've maxed out Clint. I'm getting close. I'm getting to the point where I could just like start selling some of this stuff to make a bit of money. So we're going to give... Wait, have I maxed on it? Abigail already? I... No, I haven't. Okay, never mind. Okay, so Abigail for... Or Amethyst for Abigail. Uh, we got some diamonds. Um, need to get more bug meat. Uh, I should swing by Krobus and give Krobus that. And get some more bug meat. Uh, Haley. I already have a coconut for Haley. Shane. Um, so what do we have here? Let's just, just, let me actually organize this properly. So we've got Jazz. Shane. Kent gets an apricot. Uh, Haley gets a coconut. Krobus. Willie gets mead. Elliot. Gets an apricot. Penny gets a diamond. Alex gets an apricot. Pierre gets an apricot. Caroline gets a fish taco. Abigail gets amethyst. Harvey gets coffee. Maru gets a diamond. Sebastian gets a frozen tear. The dwarf gets a topaz. And Leo, we're not going to give gifts to this. So I have everything I need. Uh, let's let's do this. Let's see if I can find everybody. Let's see if I can. Uh, wait a minute. I need to get these artifacts paused just in case I get a chipped amphora. There's Jazz. 
Jazz, you got a pancake. Am I closer with Jazz now? Do I have nine hearts? No, still only have eight. Shane gets a hot pepper. We maxed out Shane. <laughs> I know I'm close. <gasps> yes, we have. We just maxed out Shane. Shane comes off my list. Nice. All right. Next stop is Kent. Let's see if I can find Kent. He gets an apricot. There's Penny. Is Kent at home? No. Where's Kent, do you reckon? He might be... There he is. Kent gets an apricot. Let's give a gift to Penny right now while we're here. Uh, that's Kent done. Haley. Forgot about Haley. Getting ahead of myself here. There's Haley. How are we doing? Willie. Crow. Oh, Willie. I should swing by Willie's as well. Maxed out Shane. So close with Maru. Haley. I'm only a couple hearts away with Haley. We're getting there. We're getting there. I think I will maybe make a stop. I kind of want to. I kind of want to do Krobus at the same time I go get bug meat, but I don't want to miss people. Oh right, this is a cutscene. I think I need this one. This might help me with Haley friendship. Hold on. Um, Haley. Pretty sure this is a cutscene. That is a friendship cutscene. Uh, sunny day, cinder sap, go to the beach. I'm really sorry. Plus 50. I'm really sorry. Great. That's going to give us more friendship with Haley. Perfect. Paul, come here quick. What you got? My bracelet's gone. I know I had it on when I got here. That's odd. But now it's gone and I can't find it anywhere. Crazy. I'll never find another one like it. I'm really sorry. Plus 50 friendship, baby. Let's get the Hits Haley thing over with. Maybe it'll wash up on another shore. I can't bear to think of it at the bottom of the ocean. It's hard to have sympathy for Haley, being that she's such a cow, but... I'm so sorry, Great Grandma. I lost your precious bracelet. Please forgive me. Could she have dropped it nearby? Yep. It's over here. It's right there. There you go. There's some friendship. Is that... You found it. Heck yeah, I did. Thank you so much, Paul. You're a lifesaver. Yes, it's true. I'm pretty fantastic. I won't forget what you did for me here. Won't you, though? I feel like that's not necessarily true. Alright, Alex has an apricot. That's Alex done. Swing by Willie's and give Willie a mead. We gotta be close um, with Willie, right? Oh, oh, super close with Willie. Super close. All right, hopefully next week we can finish Willie up. Finish friendship with Willie. Uh, so that is Ch Elliot. Elliot. There we go. Okay, again, we're going to wait on Krobus. Um, swing by. We've maxed out Gus. We've maxed out Emily. Uh, so, Willie, Elliot, Penny, Alex. So, Pierre, Caroline, Abigail, Harvey. I think Harvey is at the clinic today. I think. Hopefully. Cutscene. What cutscene is this? Hold up a second. I gotta figure out what cutscene this is. I feel like... Sick of printing this up. I feel like this is a Maru cutscene. Let me just confirm that. Uh, enter the clinic when Maru is there. There we go. Tell Harvey it was an accident is what we want to say. 
Boosh. Ah, uh, oh no! The whole sample is ruined. Harvey's gonna kill me. Paul, what should I do? Tell Harvey it was an accident. Yes, tell Harvey it was an accident. You're right, I should just tell him the truth. That's plus 50 friendship. <laughs> what happened? I heard something break. I accidentally dropped one of the samples. I'm so sorry. Thanks for telling me the truth, Maru. Don't worry about the sample. We'll just get another one. Ooh. <laughs> what kind of sample was it? Thanks for being patient with me, Dr. Harvey. <laughs> patient, get it? Of course, you've been a big help around here. I don't know what I'd do without you. I should be good if Maru was here, too. I could give her a gift. Paul, you look a little pale. Are you feeling okay? <laughs> I'm out. There she is. There's Waifu. Whoops. Uh. Oh, really? Sebastian likes void eggs as well, huh? Hmm, interesting. Uh, alright. And that's for Harvey. Nice. Okay, how are we doing with Maru and Harvey? Maru, super close. Harvey, also super close. We might, potentially, maybe tomorrow, Max and Harvey? That'd be sweet. Okay, uh, so that's that done. So I gotta get the Caroline, Abigail, Pierre thing. There's Abigail. Don't you run from me. Don't you run from me! I'm glad you moved here. Still not marrying you, Abigail. Uh, how are we doing with Abigail? Got a little ways to go yet. There is Pierre, and there's Caroline. Very nice. So Pierre, you get an apricot. And Caroline, you get a fish taco. Um, how are we doing? Pierre, eight hearts. Caroline, eight hearts. Abigail, I think I looked at Abigail already. Six hearts. <laughs> okay, uh, so who's left? So Jazz, Kent, Haley, Krovis, uh, Willie, Elliot, Penny, Alex, Pierre, Caroline, Abigail, Harvey, Maru, Sebastian, and the, and the Dwarf. Uh, we'll do them later, actually. Let's go do Krovis and get some, uh, some more bug meat. <clears throat> then we'll see. I am kind of tempted to go back to the mine, or to make the mine the easier mine. Um, just to guarantee getting bug meat. Oof, nine hearts with Krovis. We are so close. We are so close. With so much of this friendship. It's all good stuff. It's coming along. Of bugs here today. This was good. This bird in the ring is gonna save my bacon. I'm telling you right now, this burglar ring is gonna make this so much easier. I'm already up to what 30. I mean, honestly, I could, I could almost just come here and do it. Really, like, because it's, it's what it's what a week, right? I got six days. And I'm a third of the way there after, like, one or two, I guess. So, like, honestly, I could almost do the whole thing. Um, could almost do the entire thing just in there. So if I can just get a few more... Uh, if I can just get a few... Uh oh triple shot right now. If I can just get a few more bug meat in the regular mine... I mean, I'll just go back to there, go back to the sewer every day and just get some guarantees, guarantees, get some guarantees. Okay, so I forgot about Sebastian. 
Um, how are we doing with the dwarf? Please tell me we're close. We're not. Okay. Should I give Sebastian now to get it over with? Maybe I should. Then I can just hang out in the mines and try and get... Uh, Try and get as many bug meats as I can. See at home this time. Oh, cutscene. I think this is a Sam cutscene, I want to say. Or is this, is this a Sebastian cutscene? Let me check. Um, enter Sebastian's room. So nothing has any effect on friendship, but we do have a walkthrough for the game. So let's let's go through. Let's do this. Sam and I were about to play Solarian Chronicles, the game. Why don't you join us? It's better with three players, anyways. Yeah, let's do it. Okay, here we go. Let me draw the scenario card. Hmm. It looks like today's quest will take us into the Necromancer's Tower to try and reclaim the Solarian staff from the clutches of Dread Lord Zarth. <laughs> Cool. Paul, are you ready to choose your character? Uh, I'm going to go... This doesn't actually matter. Uh, I'm going to go healer, though. I probably would do that in real life. Healer, huh? That's a very important role. I guess I'll pick the wizard, then. Cool. Warrior's my favorite, anyways. Let's begin. The king has entrusted you and your companions with recovering the Solarian Staff, a task which, if completed successfully, will ensure your place in the Hall of Legends as well as a sizable fortune of gold and silver. After a long month journeying, journeying across unforgiving lands, you step out in, onto a precipice to see your destination looming in the distance. Take a flight or something. There, beyond the moonlit plain, lies the Necromancer's Tower, where Dread Lord Zarth usurps usurps the power of the stolen Solarian staff for his vile purposes. Wow, that's a mouthful. The tower lies before you. We're going to go through the front door. A skeleton guards the hallway before you. It looks dangerous. What do you do? Fight. The skeleton lunges forward. Shield. You successfully block the attack. The skeleton stumbles backward, giving you enough time to strike out and slay the foul creature. Got him! You continue down the hallway, taking care not to step on the skeleton's remains. You find yourself in a sewer-like corridor. To your left, a hallway glows with a peculiar green light. To your right, a staircase leads up into the dark. We're going to go to the light, apparently. Hallway to your left. See some capsules. We need to destroy the capsules. You are in a room. On your left is a ladder. On your right, three prisoners are floating in strange glowing capsules. They appear to be in the process of some kind of transformation. Could this be some sick experiment of the Dread Lords? Uh, destroy the capsules. After putting these poor souls to rest, you and your companions climb the ladder. Final battle. Healer. Heal Sebastian's wizard. Okay. You have come to a door at the end of a hallway. The time has come to face Dreadlord Zarth. He's all like, say, what? Intruders, how dare you trespass in my private chambers? Ah, so you've come for the Solarian staff. Heck yeah, dude. Fools, you'll make a nice addition to my skeleton army. Dreadlord Zarth casts Shadow Beam. You were able to dodge the spell, but your companions are gravely injured. Heal... The Wizard Sebastian. Yes. Thanks, Paul. You're welcome, Sebastian. Sam's like, weak. Sebastian casts Pure Bolt. A beam of white light hits Zarth square in the face. The Dread Lord shrieks and crumbles into dust. You pick up the Solarian Staff and hold it high. Order has been restored to the world. You finished the scenario with an A rating. Thank you, Wiki. Hey, not bad. It took me like three or four tries to beat my first scenario. Well, you didn't have the Wiki available, so that makes sense. Uh, thanks for stopping by. I'll see you later. Peace. Next time I'll like 
do everything the opposite of that. There we go, that's for you, Sebastian. Okay, so I think we're about good. Uh, we've done all the gifting we can or need to do today. We've maxed out Gus, which is awesome. Um, I'm just going to make sure I make a note of that. Um, oops. <clears throat> maxed out Gus. Uh, we're close with Willy and Krobus. Nine hearts each after two gifts, so that's good. Uh, Pierre, which is going to be a grind. Jazz, I don't think I have any of the loved gifts for Jazz, so that's going to be a grind now. Caroline, I have some green tea and stuff, so that'll, be, that'll go a bit faster. We've maxed out Shane, Emily, and Leah. We're super close with Maru. I'm tempted to... Because I need to get 14 hearts with Maru. The problem with a spouse is that you have to give them gifts every day. And I don't think I have enough diamonds yet. But I, I don't know how long it's going to take me to get that friendship up there. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm going to have to marry her pretty soon, I think, just to be safe. Uh, close with Alex, close with Harvey, close with Abigail, close with, with Haley. Haley, I got lots of coconuts for Haley. Um, yeah, see, the problem is that my, I'm splitting double duty because I need diamonds for Penny as well. Um... What else does Penny love? Emeralds. I could give her emeralds, I guess. And I still have that red plate. So I could give her the red plate. That would be good. Any loved gifts? Elliot's just going to be a grind. I don't have pomegranates. And then Leo and Kent's going to be a gong show. <laughs> I'm a little bit worried about that. I may have kind of spread myself too thin in the first year. But we'll see. Time will tell. All right, so let's just check for bugs. Am I going to see lots of bugs here, or do I have to change the mine back? There are a few bugs. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I'm also not too excited about these octopus. So I think I might wimp out. Put the mine back. Yes. There we go. Okay, so for today, gotta keep going. So let's eat things. Um, I've never eaten a sweet pea. Gonna eat it right now. It's not gonna do me any good, but whatever. So yeah, I just need as much bug meat as possible. There we go. Oh, that stuff uh, did pretty well. All right, do I have enough to put any more thing? I do have three. Ooh, yeah. Kind of need the iron. I still need it. I can make three more kegs if I had the iron. Hmm. Not in a word. Great. Oh well. What do you do? Okay, let's get let's get organized here. In fact, you know what? I'm just gonna throw some of this stuff out. I'll make a little bit of money from it, and it'll it'll be out of my stay out of my inventory. So let's get rid of you, and get rid of you. And, all right, we're probably good. I wonder if I should upgrade to a gold garbage can, too. That would be kind of handy. That would be useful. All right, let's try 25, maybe? I have no idea. Oh, I do see. Okay. We're up to 36. It's a bit of a grind, but that's all right. I'm just here for the bug meat. Still need... I mean, at some point, we have to make a point of, of you know, getting into these mines and... Uh, finishing the... all the killing things quests. All right, I'm just gonna leave. I don't wanna mess around with those octopuses. All right, I'm not seeing any bug meat, so let's leave. All 
All right, level 20. Let's try it. Ooh, all a shell. Thank you. Oh, there's another buff down there. Might as well get rid of that guy. Get rid of this guy. Grab the coal, copper, rather. Ooh, nice, another all shell. See a bug up here somewhere? Oh, there's a ladder there, though. Since there is a ladder, I will. Oh, ladder here for me, too. Sweet. Okay. Bugs. One. I'll take it. Thank you. Run away. Actually, I gotta watch my health here. Health is a little bit low. Let's go topside. And let's eat some stuff, uh, like, for example, uh, I guess, well, I could eat this. And we will also eat, uh, I guess we're eating these guys next. Yeah, let's eat that. I was like, ooh, I have bug meat, I can make bug steak. No, I need to keep the bug meat because I'm trying to do the willy quest so I can get the recipe for the quality bobber so I can make all the recipes. I think there's an there's another thing that I have to do for a recipe that I think it might be a bit of a pain. Oh, it's the solar panel one. Yeah, that's not going to be great. That's not at all going to be great. Crap. I kind of have to wait, though. I kind of can't... I'm thinking, oh, maybe I should... I should kind of get some stuff ready. Um... I was thinking that maybe I, should, I could get some stuff ready, you know, get some taro tubers ready or whatever. But, I think you have to grow them while the quest is active, and it could be one of three things. It's those, you know, taro tubers, ginger, or, uh, pineapple. So, yeah, I don't know. 52, we're halfway there. We are halfway there. Getting a decent amount of uh, copper too, which is nice. There is overrun with monsters. Hey, goodbye. Let's throw that in there. Oh, it just ran out of triple shot. All right. Try level ten. Let's not try level ten. Let's try 15. 15. I need to eat. These octopuses are wrecking shop. There we go. That'll help. 63. We're doing really well, actually. I'm really happy with this that this bug meat quest, quest is going as well as it is. Can we just a bit of a load off the mind? You know, I've been using... I'm probably going to burn through these salmon berries, which means I'm going to be using apricots, but I need to make sure I keep enough apricots to give gifts. I've got to be a little bit careful there. You have to be a little bit careful with that. There we go. Leave. I wish I had... I don't have the wood for it anyways, I guess. Or no, I got the wood at home. I'm tempted just to go down to level 40 and just get enough iron to make three bars. I need 12. If I can just get a little bit of iron don't need that much. Um, do these guys give me bug meat? They do.
do. Mm. Oh, oh, why am I stuck? Okay, I gotta leave. No idea why I got stuck there. This is sweet, actually. This is a decent source of bug meat on these levels, so I can get some more iron. Which do I have? Eight? Super close, actually. I guess I'll grab this hardwood while I'm here as well. Okay. Oh, I should have got other hardwood. Whoops. Oh my goodness. Don't like that. So we want to skip level 43, is the lesson we've learned there. Back to level 40. Just need a little tiny bit more iron. Ooh, yes. Ooh, and I see some radioactive ore. Give me that bug meat. 72. We're, we're, we got this bug meat thing in the bag. Honestly, this is like incredible. We got this in the bag. That's not my pickaxe. There we go. That's a bit more radioactive ore. That will give me, hopefully, another heavy tapper. Uh, these are bats coming for me, which I don't particularly care for right now, so let's just leave. What do we have? Oh, we're so close. I need one more piece of iron. And I can make the cakes tomorrow, I guess. I just need one more piece of iron. Come on. One more piece. Dang. I want that bug meat, though. Alright, one more piece of iron. There it is. I see it. Nice. Okay, I'm gonna grab some more bug meat. It's gonna make my day tomorrow quite a bit easier. I literally grabbed no bug meat there. But we got 79, so I'm not mad at that. 11.30 p.m. Let's go throw this uh, iron in the furnaces just to make sure we get it tomorrow. Uh, I'm going to write down that tomorrow in game, which is summer the 10th. So summer 10. I'm going to check. I'll go green house question mark. Whoops. Um, so we've got uh, radioactive iron. I need more kegs. Um, Three iron at the mine for kegs. Did Gus's birthday. We actually did the secret woods quest already. When you go upgrading the house, immediately. Secret notes, cooking and crafting were super close with anyways. Other quests, I'll put a question mark there. We've got to keep an eye for other quests. Um, uh, we're going to finish bug meat quest hopefully uh, 11 40 p.m oof one more radioactive ore i can get another bar that would be super useful to me so let's see if we can get one more let's just see if we can get one more uh yeah it's a level 40 again so i can still need more bug meat Prismatic shard. <laughs> nice. Nice. It was nice with the prismatics. I've had so many prismatics this run. It's kind of crazy. How many? Because I've got, I've got the galaxy sword. I've got the uh, um. I've got the galaxy sword. I've got you know the galaxy hammer upgraded. So that's two. 12.30, I need to keep an eye on the time a little bit. Um, oh, my inventory is completely full, uh, so let's do this. Let's uh, eat something. I'm just going to eat these just because. Pick up that gold. There's a bit more iron there. Do I grab that or do I not? I feel like I do. And then I feel like I go. I feel like I leave right now. 
Okay. Sweet. So we've got enough radioactive ore. Put another one of these guys in. Can I do it with a full inventory? Yes, I can. We got some iron. Um, let's put another iron bar in there. A little bit of gold, a little bit of everything. Uh, okay, is there anything else I want to leave behind? I don't think so. Five squid ink. I'm tempted to... Wait, no, I'm not. I was going to say I'm tempted to make like a squid ink ravioli, but that's only for fishing, which I don't need to do. I mean, I guess I could keep some because I think there's a fishing quest I need to accomplish, I think. Uh, do I have the quest open still? No. Let's just double check the quests here. The special orders. Um... Yeah, this, this one right here, this island ingredients one. Crops must be harvested while the quest is active. The problem, so I could plant them all and have them all grown. But that's 300. I can't afford the spots. I need the spots for starfruit. So, I mean, I guess I could probably start keeping start keeping taro roots at least and ginger. Because um, how do you plant? Can you just plant ginger? Like, how do you, how do you harvest it? Sources foraging. Really? Wow. Okay. So I... Hmm, okay. And then the pineapple. I have some pineapple. I guess I can start gathering pineapple seeds too. And if I gather some taro roots and some pineapple seeds, then at least I'll have them all and I won't have to like build up. So maybe I'll write that down too. Um, gather pineapple seeds and taro roots for... Caroline quest. Now, when do I get that quest? Oh, just Ginger Island unlocked. Yike. Okay, so that could happen anytime. That's a little scary. Um, Clint wants you to kill 50 things. I think I've made that one already, haven't I? I don't know. Either way, that's this this quest, this Caroline quest is the one that I'm really worried about. Uh, other than that, who would give me a fishing quest? Maybe... Linus, I have the fiber seeds recipe already. Uh, Willie, gonna get the best not fishing. Um, this one here, this tropical fish catch, catch five fish, or maybe five of each. Easy, easy money. But that's not even gonna don't even get a recipe for that. I actually think I'm pretty good. I've got the monster musk recipe, the mini obelisk. I'm gonna get the quality bobber here soon. I've got stone chest. Um, got the fiber seeds. I got the bone mill. I got the farm computer. If I do, I have the geode crusher. Like I might done it, done it, except for yeah, I have the geode crusher. I just need to make it. So the solar panels, that's actually really sweet. <laughs> We're actually super close to having that done. Uh, all right, let's head back to the farm. My triple shot gonna last me? Yes, it is. Grab a grape. Why not? I might just sell this prismatic, to be honest. What else am I going to do with it? Well, I will make that ancient seed thingy into an ancient seeds thingy. Sell that. We'll need nine more bug meat. Oh my goodness. Sell the rice shoots. Oh, sell the red mushroom. Do I sell the squid ink? kind of feel like I do. Also, like, I'll keep, I'll keep a couple of them. Keep a couple of them. Um, okay, let's quickly deal with some inventory. Combine some of that. Go over to here. Combine some of that. I mean, I'll leave those in there as well. Um, so I can make three more. I don't have enough wood. I'm going to write that down. So I can make more kegs, but I need more wood. Um, I guess I could make some more... Uh, make more tree fertilizer. I'm gonna go do some replanting of stuff. Um, yeah, but what a day. Look, 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 look. Look how short this list of checkboxes is. It's tiny can fit on one screen. 
So good. So happy about that. Um, super close. So I do make a Geode Crusher. Just make it right now, actually. And it's what, two diamonds and a couple gold bars. And what else does it need? Geode Crusher. And where is it? Two, one diamond, two gold bars. 50 stone. Easy. One diamond, two gold bars, 50 stone. Geode cr One diamond. I put both diamonds away. One diamond. There we go. Geode Crusher has been made. Take it off my list. Thank you very much. Uh, yeah, we're doing really well. Um, I need to get the... Ooh, the Desert Totem Recipe. That needs 10 Iridium Bars. Crap. I just... Yeah, the Iridium situation is dire. I'm gonna need something to... I mean, I just need to do more skull cavern runs, really. That's really all it comes down to. I just, I need to get, need to do more skull cavern runs. I'm just so bad at them, it's like, it's kind of depressing. Uh, alright, so that can go in there. Geo Crusher can go in there. I might just sell this truffle oil right now. I do have a tapper I could put somewhere, no idea where. Um, but I'll worry about that another time. Let me throw the squid ink in the fridge as well. Uh, the fridge is there. Boop. I have I already have five in there. Pet the dog. I already pet the dog. Never mind. Okay. Well, that was a fantastic thing. We got so many things. Made a bit more money. Going to get the house done. Um, did a ton of crafting. We caught up on... Uh, we shipped got all the shipments done. We've done the, um, what else have we done? I don't even know, but whatever it is, it's a lot of it. Uh, things are going super well. We're going to have the house upgrade soon. Queen of Sauce is going to give me a complete breakfast, which I know how to make. That's great. Um, what do I have in the mail here? Some basic fertilizer that I can get sold. Uh, the Luau. <gasps> the Luau. Because the Luau gives you friendship, does it not? Um, potentially, because it, it, you're in 120 friendship points with villagers if any of these items are used. If I can come up with something, um, blobfish. No, coconut wine, crimson, crimson, crap, crimson fish. Goat, goat cheese. <gasps> oh, a silver quality goat cheese. I might be able to get a silver quality goat. No, wait, no, you can't. You, don't, you only get them a large goat milk, though. I could potentially get a large goat milk, but silver quality. But silver quality, yeah, potentially. Potentially. If I could get a good quality large goat milk, um, that would do the trick. Pale ale. I could just do a... How do you make a pale ale? Is that wheat or something? But it needs to be quality, though. Yeah. Um, or a starfruit. Bam! I'd do a starfruit for that. Yeah, I could just do a starfruit. Okay, there we go. So, the luau is... What day is the luau? The 11th of summer. Alright, so I'm going to write that down. So, summer 11. Take silver large goat milk or um what was it or silver star fruit yeah silver so silver large goat milk or silver star fruit to luau that will give me 120 friendship points hopefully i'm not actually sure if that's gonna work um because i don't know if it gives you friendship like it would have given me friendship the first year because i would have done it the first year but i don't know if it's gonna do it Again, having done it the first year, I don't know. But if it does, I mean, that would be huge. That would prob potentially, I mean, probably not with Krobus, maybe help with Willy. I mean, it'll help anyways, right? Like, I'm so close with so many people that it's 120 friendship points is a lot. That's like a half a heart. Um, so yeah, so I try for try for a goat milk. We got some more, uh, some more of that there. Um... 
Let me just quickly look in the greenhouse, see if anything I need to do in the greenhouse. I do need to do the greenhouse for sure. Uh, but yeah, so I think that's pretty much it. That's pretty much the plan for next time is we're going to do the greenhouse. We're going to do try and get some more iron, get some more kegs going. Um, I might just start putting stuff in the kegs right away just to start burning through the star fruit because I'm going to end up with a lot of star fruit very soon. And I've only been completely in total. I've made 227 kegs, which is not enough. So I should probably keep the kegs going constantly. Um, but yeah. So we'll do that, do some more tree stuff, finish the bug meat quest. Very happy about that. Uh, and if I have some time, we'll try and get some more heavy tappers going. Um, I probably should have left them. I, if I realized I was going to get that many, that much bug meat, I wouldn't have flipped the mine back to easy mode. Yeah. Uh, oh, well. And then I'll start, I'll see if there's a way to gather some pineapple seeds and taro root. I'm pretty sure you can trade for them maybe at the desert trader or the island trader maybe you can get some pineapple seeds or something it's probably not a great trade but we'll see let's actually i have the uh no it's island trader island trader i put trander for no reason you can get one tarot tuber for two bone fragments that's actually not bad i could grind that out pretty easily and one magma cap gives you one pineapple seed Ooh. Maybe I will. I might have a couple extra sprinklers kicking around somewhere. Potentially, I might not. But if I do, maybe I'll just get some pineapples growing. Um, and then, yeah, hopefully they'll give me a bit of a start anyways. Or I can make like a sprinkler just to get some pineapple seeds, some pineapples growing. Yeah. Anyways, long story short, that is the plan for next time.